Do you know that you can make your perfect rare, medium or well done steak using smart home gadgets? In today's video I will show you such smart gadget called Meter. Did you get it? It's a combination from meat and thermometer. I will also integrate that meter with home assistant so advanced automations and notifications will be possible. I must say that this is not a sponsored video I bought this meter product with my own money and what you see next is my own opinion and experience. I always wanted to control the doneness of the steaks and other type of meat when I have a barbecue party as most of my family members like it well done, but I prefer to experiment with medium to rare. I saw this meter product around the Home Assistant 2022.5 release as it was one of the featured integrations. The name Meter immediately grabbed my attention as I was looking for such smart thermometer for meat from a long time and this one looked promising. On top it can work with Home Assistant which was a deal maker for me and I decided to buy one for a test. So let's see what Meter is and what you can do with it. Meter is a wireless smart meat thermometer and along with the Meter app or Home Assistant it will help you cook the juiciest steak, chicken, turkey, fish or other meats perfectly every time. There are three different flavors of Meter products, the original Meter which have up to 10 meters wireless range, the Meter Plus that can go up to 50 because it has a built-in Bluetooth repeater and the meter block which is basically two or four meter props in one charging station. I won't go into details about the meter specifications and so on, you can check them in Amazon or in the official meter website. I'll just say that the original meter costs around 70 US dollars, the meter plus is around 100 dollars and the meter block is around 300 US dollars. I bought the meter plus version only because I found it with free shipping which makes the price difference between the original meter and the meter plus negligibly small. If you're interested to buy a meter I can suggest to check the current prices and of course you can use the links in the video description. Using meter is very easy as there are no wires and no hassle. You just have to pair the device with your phone using the Meter app. For the Meter app you need to create a user and this same user will be used later for the Home Assistant integration. In the app you will find all of the needed instructions for the pairing process. When you are ready you can insert the Meter probe into your meal, you can set up your cook by choosing it from a enormous digital meat catalog. You can set the stage of doneness and you can start cooking as usual. The Meter app will report the internal meat temperature as well as the ambient temperature. It will estimate the cooking time and it can even consider the resting after the meal is ready to achieve the best results. A quick side note before we continue to the Home Assistant Meter integration. I want to invite you on my Home Assistant webinar where I'm talking about different official Home Assistant installation types plus one secret and stupid easy way to get Home Assistant up and running. Check this webinar on my website automatelike.pro slash webinar. It is completely free and it will take you only 45 minutes to understand almost everything about the Home Assistant installation types. Now let's go back to the Home Assistant meter integration which unfortunately is not local. It uses the meter cloud and I'm perfectly fine with that but just mentioning it because I know that some of you want to use only local integrations and smart gadgets. Anyways to integrate meter with Home Assistant you need the meter app credentials and you should have completed at least one cook while you was connected to the meter cloud. The whole Home Assistant meter integration is very easy. Here is what you have to do. This is my test Home Assistant. I'll go to settings, devices and services, 
at integration and I'll search for meter. Here it is. Make sure that you have at least one meal cooked with your meter before you proceed. I'll type my meter username and my password and I'll click submit. Success! Created configuration for meter. Let's see this. I have this integration right here, but it is empty. After one or two minutes, my home assistant meter integration showed one device and eight entities. Let's see what are these entities. And as you can see, I have eight different sensors. At the moment, only meter probe internal and ambient sensors are working. But if I start a cook, let's try this. I'll tap to set up a cook. I'll choose a custom cook, for example. I'll select, it doesn't matter actually. Start cook. Insert your meter probe. Okay, I'm inserting my meter probe. Place your meter plus charger near to your probe and start cook. Sound output appears to be muted. Okay, and my cook is started. Let's see if I will have my readings in Home Assistant. I guess, yes, it is working. Meter probe cook state becomes configure. Meter probe cooking is at unknown state. Meter probe elapse time is several seconds. I have a meter probe peak. Meter probe remaining is at unknown and meter probe target is 32 degrees, exactly as I set it. Let's end this. Yes. And I'll start a new cook, ribeye beef. Start cook. Start cook again, start cook. It is muted, okay, I know that. Okay, it seems that when you are not cooking, some of the readings, some of the sensors are not working in Home Assistant, which is totally fine. Now I have this reading as well, meter probe cooking is revised stack, but I don't have the remaining time. And probably because I'm not cooking at the moment, I just test this. If I have the ambient temperature, I guess this should be also working. Okay, we have the meter added in Home Assistant and we have all the readings. The whole point of doing this is that you can now create a ton of useful automations that can sound the alarm, send you notifications or even call you when your meal is ready or the temperature is not right. And because Home Assistant can use a lot of services and integrations, the choice what to use exactly is entirely yours. If you like that meter gadget and you want to buy one for yourself, you can use the links in the video description. As Amazon affiliate, I'll receive a small commission from your purchases with no additional cost for you. Thank you for watching. I'm Kiryu and I'm done speaking. Bye!